Cedric County Environmental Resources presents the Trash and Recycling Video. If you recently moved to Cedric County or have purchased a home for the first time and are curious about your trash and recycling options, keep watching for a complete overview of trash and recycling in Cedric County. In Cedric County, residents may choose which trash and recycling provider they prefer to use. But with multiple options, where do you begin? Before you choose a trash provider, search for local companies online or call around to compare rates and services that work best for you. Coupons for providers often are found in the back of the local phone books. Remember that some neighborhood associations and smaller cities will have contracts with specific providers, so check with yours before signing up for a service. If you don't belong to a neighborhood association, ask your neighbors which service they use, as well as the pros and cons of those services. Most trash providers in the area offer curbside recycling for an additional fee. The items accepted may vary by provider. Many local businesses also accept recyclables at no charge. A full list of locations that accept items from aluminum cans to yard waste can be found online in the Sedgwick County Environmental Resources Recycling Guide at www.sedgwickcounty.org. Items accepted vary by location, so check the recycling guide before you head out. Waste that is hazardous when introduced into landfills, such as old paint, cleaning products, vehicle fluids, and old medications should not be thrown into the trash or flushed down the toilet. You know, it's most of that stuff sitting in the garage, under the kitchen sink, and in the back of the medicine cabinet. Instead, take these items to the Cedric County Household Hazardous Waste Facility at 801 Steelwell Street in Wichita. The Household Hazardous Waste Facility will take accepted items at no charge to Cedric County residents and even provides a swap and shop where residents can take discarded household hazardous waste for their own use. One person's trash is someone else's treasure. The facility processes more than 1.5 million pounds of household hazardous waste per year and is ready and waiting for yours. They even host collections throughout the county each year to help residents clear the garages and homes of this type of waste. For a list of items accepted at the household hazardous waste facility, hours of operation, and directions to the facility, visit www.sedgwickcounty.org or call 660-7464. Bulky waste also has a place in Sedgwick County. When disposing of bulky waste, check with local recycling companies first. Many companies will actually pay to take that old metal and other items off your hands. A number of landfills and transfer stations that accept large waste, such as appliances, furniture, demolition, and tree waste are located throughout Sedgwick County. Or, if you have too much stuff to haul yourself, call a local junk hauler to take it away for you. A list of these sites and resources can be found on the Environmental Resources website at www.sedgwickcounty.org. Opportunities to reduce, reuse, and recycle are all around us. With a growing amount of yard waste ended up in the landfills, we remind you to mulch, mow your grass and leaves. Or, empty your clippings into a compost pile to use as fertilizer instead of into plastic bags. Sedgwick County also hosts a number of collection events to recycle materials such as used tires, electronic waste, used turkey oil, and Christmas trees during the weeks following the holidays, minus the tinsel and lights, of course. We hope you now have a better understanding of trash providers and recycling options in Central County. We encourage all residents to reduce, reuse, and recycle. For more information about recycling or waste disposal in Central County, call Environmental Resources at 660-7200 or visit them online at www.sedgwickcounty.org. 